We still use from 2000 years till now these clay vats, okay? We have, we have 800 uh, liters capacity, 1000 liters capacity. It depends. Uh, they are handmade. They don't make it anymore, unfortunately. Uh, and on this, we try to reproduce the old technologies. So, this is the old Alentejo, the old way of wine. But in that specific region where we are from, from Vidigara, it's still the method that they use to make the wine. In that specific cities over there, Vidigara, Vila de Frach, Cuba, also, the Alentejo. Of course, <laughs> we use these these vats and these the, this tip, we use local grapes, grapes like Tinta Grossa, Oreto, uh, Trincadeira, uh, Aragonese. It's Aragonese. It's a Spanish Tempranillo. We have it here. In a, it's different, of course, but, um, in Alentejo, and we we put everything in these young forests, and we do manual maceration. And it's fermented everything on the amphoras. But the grapes, the stems, everything is okay. And it's fermented for 13 days, 14 days, 12 days until the fermentation stops. And then stays in the amphoras until now. We call it the San Martino. It's a local facility and it's next Sunday. Tomorrow? Tomorrow? Tomorrow. We, will, we, will open, we will open our amphoras. In, on, on Saturday, so if you want to fly from the Netherlands, oh. <laughs> please be. You, you, we are, you are our guests, yes. and we, are, we do a, a, a big, a big uh, facility uh, with several producers, and we open the vet, we open the forest. So we say that in the summer to your day, we open uh, the forest and test the wine. And uh, the traditional way of doing wine in Alentejo for two, 2000 years. So it's the, the same method, not the same method, because it, it was introduced in Spain and Portugal 2000 years ago by the Romans. But it's the same method using the forest that started seven years ago in Armenia. Okay, then came to Georgia, to Italy, uh, and then came down to. to, to Spain and Portugal. 